twelve dollars plus you get penicillin with it. Four. <laughs> Man, if I could, you know, if I could go back, I'd do it all over again. Hold on, guys. Here's the order. Here's the 82 cello. Hey, Andrew, there are spots, man. Go right ahead. Bunch of spots left, my brother. All right, 82 Cello, Joe C. First one goes to you in this pack. You get the Paul Moscow. We pulled a Rifkin a couple days ago. First time we ever pulled one out of here. Eighty-six Fleer, ten dollars a box. Yeah, that's about what they went for. I remember his Ernie Witt spot too. I remember going to a card show. It must have been about nineteen ninety-one or nineteen ninety, and they had eighty-four. No, it couldn't have been ninety. It had to be earlier because I couldn't drive there, so it had to be like in the late eighties. Eighty-four PG Hockey for like ten dollars a box. Nobody wanted it. it. Just sat there. Eighty-five of PG Hockey, ten dollars. You know, nobody wanted it. Here's spot four, Juan Berenger. I remember going down to the candy store by my house. Maybe it was 89, 88. He found a whole few cases of 73 uh, hockey rack packs. One dollar. I'm buying them for a dollar. Scott, you're probably buying them for 49 cents when they came out. I remember buying clear boxes. Spot five. Like eight to twelve dollars a box, and then selling the sets with stickers for twelve dollars a set. I get three sets per box. I was blowing them out on SC Day back in the day. It's gross, isn't it? You buy ten, twelve boxes at a pop, boom. You get 30, 40 sets. Sticky Thon. Yeah, and somebody bought those sets, and they're still sitting on them somewhere in someone's closet. Well, they're fine, and they're wrapped. They have my business card, and they're wrapped in cellophane. <laughs> Spot seven, Freddy Patek. Freddie, poor Freddie. He was five foot four, weighed a buck forty. What's very amazing in 1971, he had 11, 21 doubles, 11 triples, six home runs, and he was five foot four. Probably stole fifty bases too. Nah. Forty nine. See. Just like to give me one short, huh? Hey, Jamie. Uh, yeah, you're in, brother. Let me see how many spots you got. You got two, Jamie. Thanks, bro. Rick Sofield, almost like Dick Schofield or Rick Springfield. It's like a mix. Steve Stone, spot number uh, nine. Yeah, back in the day, man. 86 Fleer Jordans, you could dime a dozen. They're still very common, but uh, a lot of a lot, a lot of counterfeits. Gotta be careful what you buy. 
Lewis Leal. Always buy PSA graded on the Jordan or B BGS, SGC, Ned Yost, spot 11. Or know how, I, know how to identify. Or know how to identify. Here's a Fernando Arroyo. That's 12. That's 82 Cello. I've got 15 spots left in my $20 snapper before I can get to the next one.